So here we are. We just arrived here in El Nido, but the main attraction here is not this place. It's actually at the sea, all the islands. We're going to do some island hopping tomorrow and I'm really looking forward to that, so let's explore. Here in El Nido you can choose between four tours. We chose the popular Tour C with places like Helicopter Island, Secret Beach and Hidden Beach, full of steep cliffs and blue lagoons. Well, the sea seems to be pretty rough today, so I hope we can go to the Hidden Beach. Here we have to swim through a hole and if the waves are too high it's just too dangerous, but we'll see. There is the entrance to the hidden beach. We need to skip this area for our second destination. We need to change the area. What? Why? For, for avoid the accident for us. Yeah, all right. So darling, darling, grab my arm Bonjour, mon ami The sweetest thing to hit the ray Would you spend a little time with me today? Bonjour, ma chérie I love it when you talk to me Though I don't understand a single word you say Your accent sounds so bourgeoisie To a hick like me from Tennessee But you make me feel just like a million francs It's like money in the bank We just finished our tour uh, to the islands here in El Nido and I have to say actually it's very beautiful but it was also a little bit disappointing because there were two places we couldn't go to that was the secret beach and um, the hidden beach the hidden beach actually you have to go through a hole and as you've seen in the movie it's dangerous the other one they're shooting a Dutch television show uh, it used to be one of my favorite shows uh, back in the days but yeah today it made us not go to a beach and last thing was that there were a lot of jellyfish in the sea so we couldn't um, uh, we couldn't snorkel the last snorkel place so there was there were some beaches left that were really nice but in general I think I was a little bit disappointed okay I was a bit disappointed but how long can it take when you come home to a place like this just drink a coffee on the terrace and I made some new friends on the beach Hello, <laughs> my name is Grietje. And you? In Haran. In Haran. And you? Ah. What are you carrying? <laughs> is it sand? Is it heavy? And I should tell you about Kawat Kalinga. It's a little bit out of the village, a little bit off the beaten track, but the view is great and it's really nice and peaceful here. If you want to know how to get there, just look in the description box. Here in Kawat Kalinga we end our trip to El Nido. I had a good time here. It's really beautiful. But eventually I don't think, no, I'm, I'm pretty sure that this is not my favorite, favorite spot in the Philippines. There's a bit too much tourism and that tourism also causes a little stress. 
And for example, when we were in Port Barton, I was so relaxed and chilled out with the beach and the people. Um, but yeah, if you are getting a bit off the beaten track, also El Nido is a very nice and a good place to go. Tomorrow we will move on. We go to Tapic Beach. It's only built half a year ago and it seems to be the only guest house in the area. So it's pretty cool. I'm looking forward to it. See you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.